Yeah, yeah, what's good? What's going on, man? It's your boy, AC Though, man. I'm back, y'all. I know it's been a minute. I know it's been a minute, man. My apologies, man. Your boy has been under the weather, man. I'm telling you, man. Like, yo, last year I got sick during Thanksgiving, and I swear it just, it never came out of my system. Like, I was sick from, like, Thanksgiving to, like, maybe the second week of December. I thought I kicked it. Went to go see the fam. It was good. Came back home, caught a stomach virus. After I got over the stomach virus, I ended up getting sick again, man. So I just been I just been down, yo. Like I didn't really get a chance to enjoy my New Year's. I had to work and I was under the weather. So yeah, man. Rough start to 2023, but all in all, I'm healthy. I'm good. I'm here. My family is good. My beautiful son is good. I really can't ask for more, man. So let's get into it, man. I have been paying attention to what's been going on in battle rap. I have been paying attention, man, and it's a lot that we need to talk about, okay? Before we do anything, man, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, support the channel, continue to support. I appreciate all the love. Let's talk about Civil War Three, man. Um, it's no, it's no doubt the whole Kid Slade, Tay Rock, you know, the whole battle was nasty work, man. It was nasty work, man. I've watched the battle at least three times. Um, battle was a very, very letdown. Um, I was very disappointed in both performances. Um, the lack of professionalism from both MCs. You know, we we were cheated a potential, you know, classic. You know, we got two heavy punches, very creative writers. Um, dudes just let the emotions get the best of them, man. They couldn't even get through their material, like. It was just embarrassing, man. But from what we did get from me after the third watch, I'm gonna tell you this: the first watch I had Tay Rock first and third, and in the second and the third watch I had Kid Slade second and third. Um, for me, it really came down to that third round. I really, really fuck with Rock's third round. Like I really fuck with the bars, heavy. Um. He seemed to be losing his breath a lot. He didn't really have the energy. He really just wanted to just get the round over with and I guess go outside and handle their business. But, um, you know, he really was just kind of just rushing through his material and pausing a little bit. So we didn't really get the feel like how we got in the first round. Um, Kid Slade, you know, he had a little hiccup in the first round, um, but his second and third round was very, you know, very, very clean. Um, he was talking to Tay Rock. Um, I thought, you know, I, I thought he did enough, you know, to to take the to take the victory. Even though with, with Rock having that crazy angle in the first, you would have thought that kind of would have just took the momentum from the battle, but it didn't. But um, I was very disappointed in that battle, man. The battle has no replay value. Um, the only thing leading up to the battle we wanted to see was pretty much the fight and there was no fight there was no fight before and there was no fight after so um in that battle there i got kiss slay 2-1 um let's talk about av versus rum itty crazy crazy fucking battle man crazy battle that battle i'm still on the fence man i only got to watch it twice i'm still on the fence with that battle bro i got rum nitty second and third um Fonz is crazy though, bro. Fonz is Fonz is crazy. Fonz had a Martin. He had a Pam or Martin bar that was, was crazy, bro. But that battle there, man, that that might that might have been the highlight for me of the night, bro. I, I'm not gonna hold you like that battle right there was, was one of the ones, man. Shout out to Nitty, man. Shout out to Fonz. Shout out to Fonz, man. Fonz, Fonz, you had an incredible 2022, man. You had an incredible 2022. Um, you're going to be right up there for champion of the year. I ain't going to lie, man. He's going to be right up there. Um, what else we got? We got True Foe versus O-Red. Another crazy battle. I, yo, I love this battle too, yo. Yo, man. This dude, bro. <laughs> this this dude is really, yo, he's really taking it to the next level, man. Like, True Foe, every time I see him, yo, he's adding something or anything he was lacking in the previous battles, he 
he's made the proper adjustments and he's winning and just just took it to another level, man. I had true for winning this battle. I had true for with the first and the third, man. Low key, actually, that first was very debatable for me. But I actually, actually, I actually old red. I actually gave the first to old red. I gave true for second and third. I, you can really argue the first for me. I mean, old red was stupid crazy in the first, but I really, really rock with true foes material in that first round like i just really rock with true foe man i'm really impressed with what i seen old red kind of momentum kind of like went down a little bit in the second and third um but he still did really good but i just i i, I felt like i feel like true foe did enough to seal the, the victory for me personally um we got New jersey twerk versus real sick this battle right here man not gonna hold you bro Dudes are saying, yo, uh, New Jersey Twerk 30, it was nasty word. Nah, son, this shit wasn't a 30 at all. If any clear round for me was the third round, when, you know, New Jersey Twerk is talking crazy to smack, you know what I'm saying? And he has some crazy haymakers in there as well. Um, for me, the first round is very debatable, bro. It's super, super close. Super close. Um, and the second round is very close as well. Um, but for me, I think I think the most definite rounds I gave New Jersey Torque the first and the third for sure. You could argue sick second round. Um, I'm not mad. I guess if you want to give New Jersey Torque the second, gentlemen's thirty. But dudes was making it seem like it was super clear. Like there was no like nah. So real sick was going crazy. Like y'all gotta stop doing that, bro. Y'all really gotta stop doing that. Y'all have to stop doing that. That's why I don't really jump out the window when I see predictions. Not predictions, when I hear people recap the battle that was in the building and especially people that go on champion. It's, it's just like, bro, man, y'all just, just, I don't know, man. Y'all just do too much, bro. But I had New Jersey twerk with the, with the 2-1. Um, Stumbles versus um, Kitchen Clean. Yo, I'm not going to hold you, bro. I had Kitchen Clean 3-0, man. Clear. I had it clear, bro. I don't know what's up with Stumbles, man. Like, he's not been clean. His material just really has not been hitting. You know, he had that crazy bar against Kid Slade. I was there every prize that shit shook the building. I haven't just really seen like an outstanding performance from him since the Snake Eyes battle. I don't know what's going on with him, bro. Like, whatever it is, he need to tighten that shit up because this ain't cutting it, bro. Like, this is like three, four losses in a row. You know what I'm saying? From the Shug battle to the Slave battle. Like, you're not winning these battles. Like, and I, I think you're going to have a serious problem, man. But, um, yeah, man. Like, that battle there was crazy. Um, but yeah, man. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't know, man. Like, I'm expecting more from Stumbles, man. Like, I'm expecting more from him, man. Like, I'm not I'm not really liking what I'm seeing from him. I feel like he could do a lot better. You know what I'm saying? He could do a whole lot better. Um, Kitchen Clean, man. Kitchen Clean. Kitchen Clean been winning, man. Um, I'm hearing rumblings of... Of... Who? who goods. I'm, I'm saying he won goods. Um, it was somebody else that he was arguing with in the spaces. Um, shit, I can't remember. Damn, I can't remember. But it's a couple matchups though. It's a couple matchups out there for Kitchen Clean, man. Um, but he's dope though. Like, I like, I like what he's been doing since he's been on URL. I'm looking forward to seeing more from him. Um, and who else, man? Um, I didn't get to see the Hansel, um, uh, Hansel versus Ease. I didn't get a chance to see that battle. Um, but overall, man, I mean. This was a pretty decent, pretty decent card. Um, app only event, so if you don't have the app, you gotta get the app so you can watch all the battles. Um, standout battles for me was Fonz and um, Nitty, O Red and True Foe and New Jersey Twerk and uh, Real Sick. Those are the standout battles for me personally. Um, if I had to rate this event one out of ten, I'm giving it about a six and a half, six and a half, maybe seven, if I'm being generous. Um, but yeah, man, those that's my prediction. Not pr prediction, <laughs> you can tell it's been a minute, man. That's my overall 
opinion on the Civil War three card. Um, let me know in the comments section how y'all feel. How are y'all rating these battles? How how did y'all call Kid Slade versus Tay Rock? I'm very, I'm very curious to see, man, because my channel really was going crazy with the whole Kid Slade and Tay Rock um, debacle. <laughs> um, but a lot has trans a lot has transpired since after the battle. So I'm curious to see what you guys think and who do you guys have winning, man. But let me know in the comment section, man. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel. I appreciate the love. Your boy is back. It's your boy, Cito, man. I appreciate the love, man. Salute, man. Happy New Year to everybody, man. Much love. Peace.